Hello everyone and welcome. Jackamus here and I'm going to start a let's play. Um, I've seen quite a few uh, and I thought I'd just give it a try, you know, uh, make a tester video, do a one day thing. So let's create a new world. What should we call it? Fun with fire, just so I remember what it's called. I'm going to leave this blank because I have no idea anything about seeds. So create world. This should give me a completely clear and free world. Playing on normal just because, well, I don't really like it being too easy. And we have spawned. Always on sand, for some reason. Just how the game works. Yeah, so um, you can see the world loading around me. Which is, well, what the world does really. Okay. Uh. That's a lovely world, isn't it? So, anyway, I'm getting distracted by the world. So, yeah, um, the first thing we need to do is get some wood. The only trees I can see are the ones over there. So, let's head over to them and get some wood. The thing about Minecraft, if you're playing just a completely unmodded ser uh, server, no, nope, uh, client, uh, it's entirely up to you what you do in the game. You can choose to have monsters turned off uh, on peaceful, so you can just build whatever you want. Uh, obviously, you still have to collect all the resources for whatever you have to build. And uh, I am punching these trees to gain some wood. Actually, well, I punched the first one, and now I'm wooding this one. Is that even a word? Okay, well, I can't quite reach up. Uh, can't reach up the top, so I'm not going to bother. So yeah, and uh, as the leaves no longer have um, wood attached to them, they drop saplings. And uh, this is one of the new types of saplings that's been added in Minecraft 1.5. It doesn't do anything different to the other saplings. It just allows you to grow kind of the dark, uh, dark wooded trees. Uh, previously, all you used to be able to do is just grow the normal trees. Even like that type of tree would drop normal saplings. But anyway, I'm getting distracted and the sun there, as soon as it reaches there, sets and creates lots of baddies. Uh, zombies, skeletons, creepers, spiders, which is not fun. So anyway, I'm going to put my wood planks, uh, no, my wood there to make some wood planks. And then I'm going to create my wood planks into a crafting table. And BAM! Crafting table. Works exactly the same as this crafting table. Just bigger. So, what do I need to do? So the first thing you really need to do is look for some coal. Now I should probably get a wooden pickaxe. Which goes like that. You're basically just drawing the item you want to make. So, yeah. Okay, uh, then you can just pick this up just by punching it enough times. You can see a pig jumping up and down in the distance. You stay over there, pig. Pigs are good, they give pork chops. So when you inevitably get hurt either by your own stupid needs by jumping off something or by getting blown up by a creeper, just eat the, ooh, coal. Eat the pork chop and you, it heals you. Right. Hooray! I, I never find coal that easy. Uh, ooh, lots of coal. Uh, yeah, you find that even if you just see just one little bit of coal, there's normally loads hidden behind it. See, look, oh, this, this is this going to be a never-ending stream of coal? Oh, but we've got some gravel getting in the way, and gravel, f uh, gravel? Nope, gravel falls. When there's nothing below it, so I'm gonna have to destroy this flipping gravel to get the rest of my coal. Uh, in fact, there's none, no more under that one. Ah, oh, there's more. I'm just gonna grab this stone as well because you need stone. Oh, there's so much gravel in here. Oh, gravel, from what I've read, is people's least favorite block in this game, and you can see why. Okay, that looks like it's all the coal. Brilliant, right? Um. Sand also has the same annoying properties. Uh, what should I build? I need to build a shelter now, so when it gets to night time, I don't get killed. 
Oh, so yeah, the reason why I've got the coal is so I can uh, do something. Oh, yeah, so I can make torches. And you need torches, so when it gets dark, you uh, don't... There's a wall there. How random. There must be a wolf around here that just killed a sheep. But yeah, so um, you can actually see what's happening in the night time. But I have now got three wool, so I can make a bed. Stop pushing me. I can make a bed for skipping the night, if I want. Uh, let's just get some more wood. I'll just make my house out of wood. It's not really... Rec oh, there's that wolf. Oh, uh, hello, wolf. Oh, I've got no bones. You need bones to tame wolves. But, uh, yeah, you um, it's not advised to build your house out of wood, because wood burns very easily. And it spreads very fast. I mean... It would probably set this whole forest on fire. Which, yeah, okay, it looks pretty cool, but it's not recommended if you're, it's your house. Uh, I really should have created a pick, uh, pickaxe. I've got a pickaxe. really should have created a woodcutter's axe, just so I can get this wood a bit quicker. How much have I got? I've got nine wood. Ten, eleven, one more. Alright, okay, I've got I've got some wood. Uh now I need a place to build. I guess this little area looks alright. I'll just build it here, so gonna make it out of wood planks. Okay, sixty three. Hopefully that should be enough. But we shall see. Is there any caves actually I can build into? Because building into a cave uh, Floating snow that you can't actually stand on. Well, that's interesting. Uh, no, that's not supposed to be like that. But okay. Um, no, there doesn't actually seem to be any caves around here anywhere. Caves are good because it means you well, it gives you stuff to do in the night time if you don't didn't get a chance to make a bed. Uh, no, nope, definitely no caves, and I'm going to hurt myself getting down from here. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to build it away from the forest. I'm going to build... Oh, no, is that a cave? Yeah, a cave. Okay. Uh, oh, with some lava. Oh, this is a very cool looking cave. Okay, I'm just going to block this exit off for now. And uh, I guess this exit too. I don't know why I just put wood there, that was a bit of a pointless waste of wood. Hooray, okay, uh, I need some torches. Uh, torches, stick, coal, torch. Lovely. So, just lighten the place up a bit. Ah, that looks beautiful. It doesn't really, but you know. Um, I was on a beach, but I can't remember where the beach is now. I wanted some sand. Uh, how long have we got? Quite a little while. Okay, I'm gonna have to run. I think the beach was over here. So I really want some sand because you can you can um, kind of smelt in the furnace sand into glass. Oh, hopefully, I've got enough time. So you can see how much easier it is if you just kind of build your house on, in in a cliff because you uh, don't have to worry about completely enclosing it. Uh, sand, yes. Okay, the sand is all covered in... Oh, I, I remember actually, when I spawned, I saw loads of clay. Clay is quite a rare resource in the game. It only, only spawns next to water, and very, very rarely. Shut up, cows. I don't want you here. Cows drop leather, which you can create into armour. Very effective in this game, because, well... A bit, even one piece of armor can mean the difference between life and death on this game. Then again, if you fall into lava, you're fucked either way. Oh shit, I've got lost, haven't I? Uh, I better not have done. I like that little cave. I swear it was just over here. No? Uh, oh, bugger. Is this it? Oh, this might be it. Over here? Oh no, that's not it either. Although that's 
A good alternative if I get lost. I'll put a torch there so I know how to find Oh, that, that didn't go well. Uh, another good alternative. But no, I like that other cave because it had lava in it. Lava is a very good resource because it can power your furnace. Uh, which I haven't even made one yet, but um, yeah, you can power your furnace, I think, for up to an hour, I read. I don't know, it's probably not as long as that, but it's it's lovely. And it can be turned into obsidian uh, when, when it touches water, and obsidian is used to create, uh, to get into the Hellgate. Ah, uh, uh, this is not looking good. Oh, actually, I swear it was near here. <laughs> Didn't I say that about the last place? Yes, I did. Uh, okay. Uh, I am just going to go back to one of those other ones I found and bunker down for the night if I can get there quick enough because now all types of scary creatures are going to start spawning and I'm I'm not well equipped. It's okay, I'll just beat them up with my block. Oh no, now I've lost the other cave. A cave over there, that'll do. So yeah, as you can see, it's now getting dark. Uh, I guess I'll have to venture off and find my other cave tomorrow, maybe. Well, tomorrow in game. Okay, where's my crafting table? Oh no, I left my crafting table there as well. Damn. It's okay, I can make another one. Right, uh, let's create a bed. Just like that. Uh, let's create a door as well, so I can actually see out. Breaking, uh, breaking wood planks takes a while. Oh, that way. Okay, and uh, I've left enough, yeah, enough space to place my bed. Brilliant, okay, I'm just going to sleep, that'll make it daytime, and uh, I shall continue the video in the morning in Minecraft.